Hey folks, Blackcross here with another discussion video. Uh, so this past weekend actually went by, and there had actually been a new video that a couple of YouTubers have been talking about recently. This game is actually an indie game. Now there are very few indie games that are actually really good that have come out so far. But this time... Holy crap! Are you ready for this one? Get this, okay? There is actually a game that's actually more or less inspired by Final Fantasy. But, in terms of how it looks, overall in the trailer itself, it's more like a combination between Final Fantasy as well as Devil May Cry. It just, it looks absolutely amazing. What is it? Lost Soul Aside. And this game, a two-year development, has only been done by one guy. One guy has made this game. It's only been one guy that's done the whole project. <laughs> and it's like, wow, really? It's just, I, I don't know what to say. It just, after it show, once it starts to show the landscape and everything that, you think to yourself, it's like, okay, one guy did this. This isn't bad. This is actually pretty good. And then it gets further into the trailer. It's like, holy shit. I mean, the detail to the game is absolutely phenomenal. So if one guy did all this, one guy? Wow! It's just I, I don't know what to say about it. It's just absolutely insane. I, I just oh, and from what we've seen thus far in terms of like what all sh was shown off, it's absolutely fantastic. Actually, and I would love to see more of this game and everything like that. But as of right now, it is still within development stage at this current moment in time. But for what it is right now, it's it, it looks really good. It looks really promising, and I love how the trailer. The trailer itself is kind of it, it, it starts off weird, where basically the guy you see him and he walks towards the door and he opens it up, and then he wakes up and he talks about how uh, he had the same dream as before, and there's like this black looking weird looking dragon type thing that's hovered around him and everything and it's like what the frick and then it go it slowly goes into the gameplay and everything like that and the gameplay with the gameplay itself it makes you literally think of devil may cry it's just wow i just oh my gosh i i can't get over it i really can't and i was talking about it with a couple of my friends and everything like that and they they were surprised about it too it just to know that one guy built all that, built all this, it was just, I, it's amazing what, what happens when you get a guy that is so into something, into the development stage. Once he gets it, once he gets his mind to work, it becomes an inspiration, and this was inspiration at its finest. Absolutely, performance well done, just absolute applause. In fact, Shia Buff. Applause. Uh, <laughs> if you don't know that video, you need to check it out. It's called uh, Cannibalistic uh, Child of Buff or something. I don't remember what it's called. I'll put a link in the description for you to check that video out. It's pretty funny. But um, just that particular, this particular game is just, I cannot wait to hear more about it. And the fact that you can check out his Facebook and everything like that. Like I said, I'll put the trailer in the description for you guys to check out the trailer yourself. And let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about this trailer. What do you think about the game? Are you looking forward to this one knowing that it is this? And are you blown away by the fact that it's one guy? I, I know I am. Just to see that this was created on the real, Unreal Engine 4. And the fact that it looks like this. I'm just... Oh, I want it now! <laughs> But I know for a fact it's going to take a little while longer for him to get it done and everything. I mean, the fact that he's already got it looking this good is enough for me to say that I think I can be a little bit patient now. But I think he's just now revealed this trailer because he's wanting to get more people aware of it and to see what type of a reaction he's getting. And I think the reaction that he's getting right now is actually really good. And I'm hoping that he keeps up with the project itself because it, I can't wait to see more. I really can't. It looks fantastic. But... I just I just wanted to get this information out to you guys because of how cool this looks. It looks absolutely beautiful. But yeah, it's called Lost Soul Aside. And like I said, it's in the description for you guys to check it out. 
And uh, let me know what you think. And this is Black Cross signing off with very, very uh, hyped emotion right now for this game. This is really good. But I'll see you in the next video. This is Black Cross signing off. Take care, guys.